So, welcome, Niklas. Hello, Matthias. Thanks for having me. Yeah, thank you for being with me. <laughs> uh, I was going to do a little quick run about you. Uh, you were born in 1972. Correct? Come again. You were born in 1972. 82. 72. Yes, correct. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Gothenburg. We, we're at the yeah, Gothenburg. Tunnered, uh, Västra Frölunda. Ah. Tunnered, that's important. That's the yeah. suburbs to Gothenburg. Uh, oh, yeah. That's um, a hockey fan. 95, what's it? Are you a hockey, hockey fan? Uh, not anymore. I don't have the time to actually okay. see it. But okay. so, if I'm there, I, I, I'd gladly watch it. Of course, uh, I love this. Yeah. Frölunda, I guess. Frölunda or um, Bäcken. Okay, I don't know. Not, that. A, not no. a famous team within Gothenburg scene. Okay. Yeah, okay. So, you have playing played guitar for Engel and In Flames, and now... You have a new exciting project, in my opinion. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, we sell the dead. Yes, correct. Yeah. What can you tell me about that? A quick run we, for. Yeah, it it, uh, it wasn't meant to be a band at first. It was actually my friend Dan uh, Don Lind, who is an actor, I suppose to say, but he's not. He's making commercial uh, films, movies, and stuff. Short films, and uh, we mapped up. Uh, maybe we should do a animated movie about Jack the Ripper around the same area, uh, but located here in Gothenburg instead. Okay. And we uh, just formed a band to to become these body snatchers who stole uh, corpses and <laughs> body parts and sold okay. them to evil priests. Yeah. Okay. And, while I was doing this, uh, Jonas Lepting, my old shallow friend, uh, wrote the script and Dan did the whole animation thing. And I wrote the music to it. And it was a little bit of a challenge because uh, I never wrote that kind of slow music. Is it possible mm -hmm. to be doomy and gloomy with hooks? That was my... Um, can I can I challenge myself to do that? Mm -hmm. And then uh, we brought in Apollo Papatanasio for vocals on this one, and it became some kind of a blend of Doom slash Black Sabbath Headless Cross kind of thing. Okay. And it was really fun to do. It was really yeah. really we had, we had a lot of fun to do it. And uh, then we had a release party at a cinema here in, in, in Gothenburg and where we showed the showcase the, the, the whole movie at, at, at whole uh, the whole thing and while I was sitting there watching it was like this is fucking bloody this is fucking gory this is, <laughs> yeah. this is epic. okay <laughs> so uh, after that we decided and the label asked us can you maybe do a proper band uh, form a uh, record some new songs to see what it's like and uh, we did that and we start to think about it and then we have even more fun doing it and uh, that recording became the album black sleep uh, which we released in late february this year we were supposed to do some festival appearance and stuff but we couldn't cause of covid this yeah night. yeah it sucks yeah, it's like, so uh, We Sell the Dead is an awful band name, by the way. <laughs> by the way. Uh, but it suited the music uh, and, and the animated movie and uh, what we do mm. within that world. Uh, it wasn't meant to be a band. Okay. Yeah, and well, I, I, think, I think it's good it, it became a band because it's, yeah, it's, yeah, it's really you. good. So, thank you. in my opinion, I think it's a mix between uh, Deep Purple, Rainbow, Black yeah. Sabbath. But yeah. but uh, with a more mo modern sound. It is. Yeah. It is. And that was the that was a little bit of the goal, as you just said. Uh, mix all this uh, classic rock, hard rock bands, and yeah. spice it up with what we can do as a musician and have a uh, uh, a production from. Yeah. I'll yeah. take it. 
do you think uh, when the pandemic is over, will we see a tour? That will rule. That will rule. Yeah. We, we actually did some dates with the band, and we had a lot of fun together doing it. And uh, the more we play, the more uh, it sounded better with each time we did a gig. So, yeah. uh, I mean, uh, it's, we, we, we're having too much fun doing it. So we yeah. would love to get on tour as soon as That's it's important. Sold. You got to have yeah, fun. Yeah. So. yeah, 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 totally. Um, is there a new album on the way? You released a new single? We uh, released a new single like two weeks ago, I think, three weeks. Yeah. Uh, we yeah. have a, uh, I think there will be a new song on the way or mm -hmm. a song with these two tracks that we are supposed to launch. Yeah. We uh, were supposed to be on the album, but we took it away because of the length of the album. Not okay. that it, this was, uh, when we felt that it, it wasn't like filler songs. It was, it is a really cool songs. Yeah. So it was a little bit like Kill Your Darlings to, yeah. to get. I even, I, I wanted to be like, yeah, you know, the awesome classic album, Heaven and Hell, Black Sabbath. Yeah. yeah. Short, and you want to hear it again and again yeah. and again. It's yeah. so awesome. That was a little bit of my idea too. Can we can we manage that? Can we even get close to that? No, but we can try. <laughs> yeah, but I think you're you're pretty close. I think it's it's a really it's really good music. So I I hope more people will discover you yeah, in this band. Thank you. So yeah. So if we move on, your biggest influence in music. I mean, uh, do you have... it's uh, my biggest influence. Uh... It's hard to tell because I, I mean, I guess you are familiar with this too, uh, this kind of stuff. You, you, you're searching for new music, new artists, new bands, you, you're listening to this and that and this and that. So, and then it goes a couple of years and you're, you're ending up making dinner for the family, kids, wife. Yeah, I know. And then you are listening to Screaming for Vengeance. <laughs> and Motorhead, No Sleep, The Hammersmith, yeah. and yeah. In Diamond, Abigail. Uh, yeah. I love this. Uh, this this will be a wonderful dinner. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so I tend to go back in time to those albums that I grew up with. Uh, Defenders of the Faith, Judas Priest, Scream of Vengeance, Holy Dive, Last in Line, Rainbow Rising, yeah. King Diamond, Rose for Fate, uh, Metal yeah. Church, the first Metal Church. Yeah. It's amazing stuff. Yeah. You're a, you you are a record collector, aren't you? Yeah, I know. Yeah. yeah. Good answer. Yeah, I am. <laughs> I, am. I, I, I love the, the the format. And my father is a, my dad is a record collector as well. Have okay. this huge collection of uh, country mm -hmm. stuff, um, and I think it's healthy. Uh, that's my. Can I say vice? No, maybe so. But I, 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 I tend to get inspired. Uh, I tend to on. Um, uh, I don't. I'm, I'm always on the move. Always try to listen to new stuff. Always write new stuff. Play the guitar. Oh, maybe I should listen. Mm, you know, I, I like this. Yeah, yeah. It's important to be uh, curious about stuff. New music, new artists, yeah. or whatever. Yeah, I, I personally, I listen to almost uh, anything yeah so, yeah but i tend to go back to the little bit heavy most of the time yeah. <clears throat> so <laughs> yeah but uh, but i can listen to yeah maybe i i, I won't put on the hit uh, radio stations as, uh, yeah if my kids are in the car maybe but but, mm. but i try to teach them <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> sometimes it works so but I, I mean, we we always have music in the house, always, always. Yeah. Uh, and there's been a quite few some time. It, it, it's been some times when we're having dinner, and the oldest one or the youngest one, Dad, why are you playing any albums? Mm. Oh no, music. No, put on some music. Yeah. So that's <laughs> important. The, the kids get used to it, and they get used to Magnum Journey, Kansas. Uh, you should buy a heap. Yeah, yeah, yeah I know. <laughs> I, I, that's a that's a maybe one of the 
for me anyway is uh, the good things about Spotify, for example. You can find everything. Yeah. You, yeah. Uh, things that you listen to when you were a little kid. And uh, yeah. maybe you don't even remember what the band's name are, but no. it's easy to find it. So, but vinyl, that's, uh, that's the shit. <laughs> it, it is actually. And I, and I love this, uh, you know, as you just said, what was the name of that band? I had one yeah. song. I loved that song. And then I talked to my vinyl freak friends and that, ah, oh, don't you know, is this yeah. with the Jamaica Heap? And it yeah. was. <laughs> yeah, but I, I remember uh, Uriah Heap. I was at uh, Sweden Rock, I don't know, 2005 or something. And I was uh, just walking around, you know, there were all these festival stages playing and uh, hey, I remember that song. And I, I didn't know who it, who it was, but they were there playing. So uh, it's fun. It is, it is. And um it should be fun all the time. Yes. Of course. Yeah. Uh, about guitars, I, mean, I think I, I uh, think that you have quite a lot of guitars. Yes, I do actually. <laughs> but a lot of guitars. Too many. No, you can't have too many. I never have too many guitars. No, no. I have, no. Uh, I have a few of them here, uh, but. It's in their cases. Yeah, yeah. I choose to. Uh, I've been playing lately a lot of the stuff I've been practicing. Wait. Yeah. I've been playing on this one. Uh, it's it's a Charvel. Okay. Um, and it's called the Bomb. Actually. Okay. Nice. Yeah. And it's, uh, I think it's, it's quite easy to get into. Maybe I should, is it possible? Yes. Yeah. yes. What was it? Uh, uh, uh. I, I I I can I, I recognize it, but uh, is it your Y and T Summertime uh, Girls? Uh, <laughs> uh, we will see if you pass my quiz later. So what? <laughs> we will see if you pass my quiz. Oh, okay. I recognize it, but I can't. <laughs> I can't say. Let's it. Seba. Yeah, Voodoo. yeah. This one. <laughs> I have it. I mean, I can't. I, I recognize everything. Yeah, warrant, Uncle Tom's cabin. Ah, warrant. Yeah. My God, Matilda. Yeah, I'm sorry. We will see. <laughs> All right. Okay. So should we do your quiz? We can do your quiz. Uh, uh, but yeah, but it's it's for you. Uh, this is a different. Um, how should I say? Time areas of music. It's uh, from the seventies to now. It's, it's mm -hmm. six songs. You, right. I think uh, you're. Uh, I think you will take every one of these. But uh, I will play the first verse and chorus, and then I will cut it if you can't. Thanks. But I think you will take everything. And let me know if uh, the volume isn't good enough. So if you don't hear it, I will turn it up. Bring it on, my friend. Yes. Here we go. Yep. Phenomena, dance with the devil. My God, that was uh, that was the hard one. No, okay, <laughs> next one. <laughs> Is 
John Oren, Eternal Flame. Great song. I want to hear that riff. I want to hear it. Okay, again. And then comes the solo. Oh my god, John yeah. Oren yeah, is the man. A, yeah, it's a great song, great album, also. Yeah, um, yeah, yeah. okay, next one. Ah, <laughs> Bolling is on. That was a down yeah from the first album yeah you have already uh, what song is it uh stone the crow yeah i'll never stone the crow oh yeah 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 and now you have already won the prize uh, <laughs> i will send that to you I love okay. it. yeah <laughs> but, but we will take the you can maybe you will be the first one to take all of all the songs all right do it a little bit longer intro Yeah. Don't know the song. Ah, but it's okay. Yeah. Oh, okay, now we will go fr from the metal to something. This is the oldest one on the quiz. Ah. Oh, oh. At first, I thought it was some some obscure Bon Jovi. I'm fine with Hallelujah song. <laughs> oh, it's far away from Bon Jovi. I, uh, you want a hint? Or can we give you the first name? Yeah, yes, Tom. Please. Tom. Yeah. Tom Kiefer of uh, former Cinderella. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Oh, I... oh, I'm out. Tom Waits. Ah, oh, oh, I never heard of. I, I actually <laughs> never heard. Ah, oh, you should listen to him. It's a, it's a, it's yeah. a bit weird some of the stuff, but really good. Okay, last one. Uh, yeah, it's Corey oh, Taylor. Oh, yeah, okay. That's correct. Yeah. Very good. Uh, most people did not, I think the most rights before in, in, in any of this quiz, I think it was uh, Tyler Strotzel, if you know who that is, but uh, he uh, he, had, he actually had a guess on, on Engel song. So... <laughs> <laughs> But he didn't. <laughs> he, did, he didn't take it. So <laughs> I, I told him that you would be on the next one. So he asked me not to tell you. But hey, no, oh. yeah. <laughs> he just had to. <laughs> yeah. That's fine. Oh, yeah, but I will uh, send this one to you. Thank it's you, Matthias. The, the tin cup. So yeah, perfect. Have your perfect. coffee. Yeah. Uh, 
But that's the last cup, cup I have. I have to find a new price. So I can't get a hold of them anymore. No, okay, okay. That's so, awesome. Yeah. Thank you. Yeah, thank you. And uh, yeah, thank you for having this little chat with me. It's very Are nice. we already done? Yeah. Or oh, do you want to say anything else? Please do. Uh, <laughs> no, I have this, <laughs> no, I have this uh, huge uh, job in front of me, putting the kids to bed. <laughs> oh, I know. <laughs> I have two old, two downstairs also, so oh, yeah. uh, the way you... <laughs> well, well, thank you very much. So that's very nice to have you on the my little show. So yeah, of course, it was yeah. a pleasure. Thank yeah. you. I, I really like quiz, and I, I like the songs. Yeah, we can do it again sometime in the future. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Just uh, call so, me up. Yeah. Just call okay. me up. <laughs> thank, thank, thank you. Thank you. Yeah, bye. -bye. bye.